once you have updated the firmware you will not be able to connect that to your computer until you power off the unit again and reboot the whole thing because it needs to reconnect to to itself actually so there we are we reboot everything and we just hope that it's going to be able to see the unit the x32 which it did beautiful and now let's see if it connects to it mixer to pc beautiful transferring parameters beautiful so we got it connected together so now my behringer x32 is controlled completely and directly from my iMac computer without the need to touch any buttons on the beautiful on the x32 now here to show you that my friend here is turning on turning the button from the volume button from the x32 and it's moving here by itself following his movements so this is just to show you there's a direct contact between the x32 controls and the iMac so from now on we're always going to control the unit from the iMac computer hope you liked it thanks